Hello, hello. Welcome to the Deborah Berry channel. If this is your first time, I am Deborah Berry. This channel is about fashion and styling and doing everything we can, ladies, to hold on to our pretty. It's about getting dressed and looking our very best. I want you to get dressed and look your very best. Always, 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 right? And to my returning subscribers, welcome back. I love you, I thank you, and I do so appreciate you. All right, ladies, it's a new week and it's time to spend with you. Hey, 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 yay, yay, yay. Don't mind me. Uh, let's see, I guess we'll do the nails first. I uh, have on, of course, Olive and June. It's just a pale color. I've shown it before. I think it's called HGC. That's my base. And I have a coat of this. This is the old. It's called Finger Paints. I think I got it at Walgreens years ago to give it a little golden, golden kind of hue. I had a, a fair to go to me and my husband uh, Friday the 1st. And I wore a dress that had gold in it or something like that. So I did the little neutral nails that's all that's all that's all but let's get to the lips let's get to the lips okay i have on a new lipstick and i'm excited to show you and it's not red how about that this is a prada lipstick it's a fuchsia color there's the box it came in now prada i got this because i was watching it's Carolyn Gray, and if you don't follow Carolyn Gray, oh my gosh, she's beautiful, she's intelligent, she's funny, she she knows fashion, oh my God, and she's so entertaining. She's a great storyteller. You know, some, some people, they can just, they have the gift of gab, and Carolyn has that, and and she's she's just, just so, so interesting to watch and so beautiful too i mean she's gorgeous i will link the video where she wore this prada lipstick in it was a red she had on and she had it on all day and she said that lipstick stood the test of times so and made me say let me go try a prada lipstick and even she said i had to pay that price this tube of lipstick is 50 dollars uh but uh, uh, and it's the monochrome Hyper Matte, it's P55 and it's called Fuchsia, but it's spelled F-U-X-I-A. I will list it below. I ordered this one from Nordstrom. I said, ooh, Nordstrom has this? Okay, look at this case, ladies. Look at that case. There's Prada right there. There's a little thing and it's Prada right there. Lovely, lovely. You know me and the packaging. Oh, I'll buy the packaging. And it's refillable. So this was $50. I'm not sure. It has a little Prada logo right up there, which you'll probably never see. Uh, I was, I'm not sure what a refill costs, but let me show it to you. And I picked this. I said, I won't get a red. I'll get this. The shape of it. It's got that little triangular shape. I had to get adjusted to putting that on but using this part, but it goes on beautifully. It dries down beautifully. I wore it to church and I had it on all day. Gorgeous, gorgeous. It really is good. You know I love my Pat McGrath. This is good too, ladies. So if you want to try Prada out just to treat yourself. And look at this. You know I love anything like that. It's got that magnet in there. It clicks on. So that's the Prada Fuchsia, P55 Fuchsia Monochrome matte what is it called the hyper matte hyper matte which you know inspired me to put on this fuchsia sweater this is an old mango fuchsia sweater and some old old target earrings they so found me some you know me in color you know i love my neutrals but mrs berry likes to break out in a little color every now and then you know <laughs> so Get the product. Oh, I, what, I, what I put it on with, I just saw, I noticed. I used this Pat McGrath lip pencil in the color um, Night Fever. And it's perfect with this. It has a pink undertone to it. So it works really well with, with this lip, lip color. So you don't have to use a pencil, but as you get older, you know, you'll understand when you get past 50, you'll want a pencil on for sure. Now, I got to show you something new I got. You know, I was hoping to get something else new that hasn't come yet. So, hence I had to like redo a whole my video idea. But, speaking of lips, remember I told you I had ordered uh, some new lip colors. 
Look what I got. I ordered from my girl, Carolina Herrera. Yes, yes, yes. It came yesterday in this beautiful box. It's packaging everything, ladies. Packaging is everything. So, anyway. I even showed it to my husband. I said, now this is a class act. So I took the top off. And inside the box, there was this. Look at that. It's quilted. It's plastic. There's this. It's just my receipt of what I ordered and everything and how to do returns or whatever. Look at that. Class. It's like when I order from Chanel. You get this. And sacks too. So I haven't dove into this as they say. I don't even know how I open this and what's going on. But we're going to see. I thought I'd wait and do it with you. Okay. I think this comes out too. Which I love because you know I love to reuse a box. Oh, that's just a top. That was just a top. Look at all my goodies. Look at all my goodies. Of course, you got all these samples. You know, I got some of the uh, good girl samples. Ooh, nice. I got, I got good girl. I got the, the black one. I got the very good girl, and this is uh, another one called 212 VIP Rose. Those were the samples I got. Yes. So let me see what I got. I bought. <laughs> I should look at my list. So let me put my glasses on. You know how this goes. I should have opened this, but I wanted you to see this packaging. My, my, my. I got. So what is this? So I'm going to be learning something. Oh, and you got this size. This is another sample I got. It's called the, J the Very Good Girl. They sent me one of these miniatures. Oh, look at her. Oh, look at her. Oh, 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 oh. I already have cologne on. But how do I? Oh, look at that. That just screws off. I have good girl. Ooh, I don't have. Look at me trying to put this back on. You know that's. <laughs> I gotta put it back on because I gotta close it up, right? Oh, it just snaps on. Okay. Oh, we like good girl. Very good girl. So you might want to check that out. I love it when you order direct, you know, you'll get special things. So I did get um, a lip gloss. This is called Good Girl Lip Liquid, but it's velvet. It's not a gloss really. And I got the color Rose Totem. Where's my fingernail file to get into this box? As you know, as you do that and pull forward and you don't tear up the, the little tail end. Packaging. I want to show you packaging. I guess I have to take my glasses off, huh? This is so exciting. This is like Christmas to me. As soon as I can get this little tab up here. There's a little tab. Okay. And look at this. Look at her. I got that in a pink. Because at the time, I was getting so much... Um, Red, so this is another pink, and what is this color called? Rosy. I just said that, didn't I? Rose. Rose Totem. And look at the case. You know, I know nothing about what I'm doing here. Let's unscrew. Let's unscrew. Okay. There's Rose. He's very tiny. Ooh, look at Rose. Look at Rose. That's even deeper than what I have on, right? Excellent. So I wanted to give that a try. Look at that beautiful holder. And I also got a lipstick in the Carolina. This is the refill. It's the 310 Carolina. So I'm going to learn how to do the refill today, I suppose. Making a mess here. 
So I got this. This is the refill of the Carolina. I got it in that. And this is a, a more, it's kind of a, I don't know. It's a red. It has a little orange in it, wouldn't you say? Oh my God, it feels like velvet going on. What do you think? It has a little, and I needed an orange red. I have so many blue reds. So, so many blue reds. I think that is, oh, luscious, luscious. Let me put this cap on. But the way you order this, you get the refills. You, it's, it's kind of like the Prada, I guess. But you order it all in sections. So this is the case I ordered. I ordered the case. And you'll see it. There were so many. It's like, I want that one. I want that one. And this is the case. I got the little black and white zebra like case so i guess you just take this off and this just goes on top of there and it snaps on snaps on look at that how cute now you notice on the the gloss the the, the mat in the tube in the glass and then this they have these little loops on the top carolina herrera has charms you can buy to add i know some some more money to spend that's not necessary so i there are so many they are so adorable um but let's see i'm a, i picked a classic one i just thought i'd do a classic one you know not go too fancy but there are so many you just want them all it's like i don't need all these but i got the red heart the carolina heart look at her so I am going to figure out how to get her off here. Oh, I've got to, I've got to get my scissors. How you been ladies? Ooh, it's trying to be spring here in St. Louis. It's really, really trying to be spring. And I hope it makes it. And Ms. Verbe put her glasses on to cut this little, they get some little clear plastic twisty tie thing on here. I'm wrecking it because I am being impatient. And I can't get that off. Almost. So, are you ready for spring, ladies? We're going to talk about some spring today. I almost got it. I know this is so exciting to watch, huh? We are almost there. Give me a second and I will get this off and I'll be right back. And just like that, she got it. But the ring, it goes on here. This goes... I still gotta figure out how to put it on there, but it goes on here. It goes on top to hang. And I guess when I figure that out, I will show you because I don't wanna like, oh, here it is here, I think. Anyway, Mrs. Berry will have to study up on how to put the ring on top. Or does it? You know, I don't know, but I'm excited about this. When I figure it out, I will share it with you because we don't want to spend the whole video trying to learn how to put that on. You know me, I'm like, I'm one of those persons that's like, I can figure this out, I can figure this out. So we'll figure it out and we will share that with you. But I will let you know the prices of all these. I think these little charms are like $23, which I think is adorable, adorable, adorable little. Get you a charm. It's just something fun. I need to get this off my hand, right? That is two beautiful colors, though, and they're both matte. I'm telling you, I am into the mattes. I like a shiny. I like a glossy lip, too. But, wow, look at that. The, the lipstick wiped off good, but look at that. Other oh, that in the, the, the ooh, that is on there. Look at there. Gotta love it. Gotta love it, right? 
I mean, that has staying power. That's this one here. Wow. Get that in another color. Oh. Anyway, that's Carolina. I love it. I love it. I love it. I probably should have opened it ahead of time. But, you know, this is real life, people. Real life and real time video for you. And this sweater keeps rising up on me. So, let's get to the topic of the day. Of the week or, or whatever. I'm smelling good. <laughs> I'm feeling good. It is springtime. As far as, you know, in our minds we want it to be spring. But this is the month for spring. And I just thought... I need to do, what's the one thing we all have for spring? We all have in our wardrobe is a trench coat of some sort. I have so many trench coats, it's ridiculous. And I never tire of buying another trench coat. So I have one that I bought probably early January, right after Christmas. Banana had it on sale. And it's the classic trench. And I went on and got it because it was marked down so low. And I remember seeing it in the store thinking, Wow, this is a sturdy trench coat. This is the magnitude of the, 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 the it's just a good heavy one, you know. And you, I like, to me, I'd like soft trench coats though, you know. I think of Columbo and his old wrinkled trench coat. But you like a trench coat that you can just wrap around and grab and do. But I, I sometimes you want that really nice one that, that lays nice and looks crisp and looks Inspector Clouseau or something, you know. Just looks really you know, like, uh, what is that, Casablanca, his trench coat with the collar up and everything. Just classic trench. Uh, then I also, I thought it's uh, it's any kind, the weather is where you can wear a lightweight coat. So I didn't really go to coats. I have three trenches from Banana Republic. Two you've seen before. I think they're going on two years old now. And um, I haven't worn them much. I don't think I've worn them out of the house at all. I've shown them in a couple of videos. So I'm gonna style those up. I'm gonna do three coat looks for you, just three. But I'm gonna like try to have a little fun with it, a little different take on it. And I'm trying, you know, I'm the neutral queen. I'm trying to add more color. I'm trying to embrace color because it's getting ready to be warm and I love color in the summertime. I still I love my neutrals too. But uh, so we'll get started and I'll put on the first look for you to go with this and we'll have fun. We'll have fun and don't forget to Carolina lips. All right, be right back. Sometimes ladies, let's let the coat be the statement. Be that girl. Be that girl that they go, "Wow, who is that?" So this is the, my first Banana Republic trench coat. Actually, it was called an opera coat when Banana had them. And I just love them. It's blue, it's lightweight, it's flared. It's got the trench coat little piece back there, you know. Has its own belt. Has pockets, of course. <laughs> Sleeves are kind of a bell shape. Very lightweight, water repellent, nice and it flares out and I put it with fuchsia. I wanted to mix it with the color. I wasn't sure of what handbag after I put all this together. You know, I have plenty of handbags that will go with the pink and the blue, but they wouldn't go with the floral shoes. And speaking of shoes, these are a pair of Frankel Sordo slings that I got. I think I might have gotten them last, of course I probably got them last summer. But they're floral and they're a little sling with a little heel. And I wasn't sure if I really liked them, but now I kind of like them. Especially with these old Ann Taylor pink little ankle pants. My little pink uh, mango, old mango sweater. And just put it under here and I am good to go. And I don't have to take my coat off because I look good just like this. I love the flare of this coat. Just easy and nice. And that's what you want to do. It's getting ready to be warmer temps and you, you get to pull out last year's lighter weight pieces or end of the season pieces that you bought that you maybe only wore once. Now's the perfect time to pull those pieces out and, and be fabulous, you know, just be fabulous. Oh, this is my old Kate Spade bag. You saw this, it's rose gold. I just thought it'll go, it'll blend. So I do need a pink bag. I really do need, I need a deep pink and I want a pale pink. And I need a 
a navy bag, as you already know. I need a nice navy bag, but I wanted to share this coat with you so you could see it and wear it and, you know, be fabulous in it. <laughs> now I'm going to do a traditional trench look for you next to show how, you know, I don't need to show you how to wear a trench coat, of course, but just a way to wear it with the neutrals, break away from this blue and this beautiful pink that I love with these fuchsia uh, Prada lips. Prada lips, Prada lips, ooh, ooh, ooh. Anyway, I'm playing, right? So I'll be right back with the next trench coat look for you. In the meanwhile, check your closet. I know you probably have something like this in there, something like, this or and I know when they did these coats they did it in a pink they did it in a hot pink and I almost got the hot pink but I figured you know that other pink coat I have I thought I need another pink coat I really wish I had gotten it though I wish they really really I wish they had done it in black and in a neutral it's the perfect lightweight coat that you could dress up or down if, if you're going out in the spring so okay Nothing is better than a classic, simple, basic trench coat. And that's what this is, but it's a heavyweight. It is lovely, lovely from Banana Republic. It was a good deal. I think that it came in black. I'm not quite sure. If it's still available, I'll list it. It was a final sale and I got a small and I really wish I had gone up to a medium. If, if it's nice, you know, if it's really good in this small, don't get me wrong, but if I wanted to wear a jacket under it, it's going to be snug. It's right there, but it's spring, so you're not going to be wearing all those jackets under something. I've got a basic, my old mango sweater, old Shein pleated skirt. I have on the old the Sam Edelman off-white boots, just keeping it neutral. Try to do a little neutral it down some after all the fuchsia and the navy. Just put those on with it. Old pleated skirt, it could be pants, it could be, you know, leggings, slim, or it could have been the riding boots under here, it would have been great. And this is my, um, I've forgotten her name already, um, Rebecca Minko, drew a blank. I love this bag, I love, love, love this bag. It makes me think of YSL for some reason, but it's got the quilting here and the snake skin. The strap and the little, it's just perfect with the neutrals. Gotta have those neutral bags, you know. And just to explain more about this lovely coat, it's got the pockets here, which I love, but it also has the snaps here with pockets here. I think they thought of it. You can stick your phone in there, your keys or whatever, and snap it up, it's secure. And you can still put your hands in your side pockets and strut them down the avenue strut on down the avenue. So, look in your closet, ladies. We all have a trench coat. And every now and then, it's really good to update your trench coats. Just add another one. You can never have too many. And a lot of them come with that zip in, zip out lining. I always hated those. It drove me crazy putting them in. <laughs> That's just me. Yeah. Give me either a winter coat or give me a trench coat. Like that, and I'll put whatever. But I love this. It's, it, I wish you could feel how heavy this fabric is. It's really heavy and the sleeves are built, but I could also button it and do it like that to make the sleeve a little more, you know, with the fold over, do that thing and put the button. But I like it like that. I like it like that. You will like it like that. So here we go with the second trench now. The next one, I'm going to go back to color, the finale. I know it's a short one this week, ladies, but I'm getting ready. I want to do some Easter-y looks for you next week. So we'll try to, you know, dress for Easter some kind of way. Some, I'm trying to do brighter colors for you because it's getting ready to be spring. Yes, 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 because spring is this month. But in the meantime, a nice classic trench coat. Cinch it up, put it on, step out. And it's about, they don't need to see what's underneath. Sometimes that coat makes its own statement, right? Be that girl. Oh! You know, be that girl that maybe Karen would stop if you were in New York. And, you know, she's watching the people and 
come on, I looked at this woman. She had on this coat and it was just so fitted and nice or I love the colors in it. But this is classic trench. We all can do this. And if you need a new trench, there's a lot of them on sale. Mango has some nice ones. Uh, and I want to get me some of those, really, those soft ones. I have one black one that's kind of in the trench family, but not, but it's out of that, the soft material, not the crisp. But this is great for a rainy, foggy day in London town, so to speak. London, St. Louis, Chicago, Illinois, <laughs> you know, wherever you are, put your nice trench on, you know. Be like bogey. <laughs> All right, finale coming up. I want to thank you for spending this time with me. I know it wasn't a long one today, but hey, sometimes it only takes triple, triple threat. That's what I'm going to call it today, triple threat. So be ready for the next one. And I will see you next Thursday. You know I'm here every Thursday. Like, subscribe, share, come back and see me. And I will be right back with the finale for you. Who says you always have to use the belt that came with the coat? You can switch up. This time I put, this is this, just like the navy coat, the first coat. This is in the yellow from Banana Republic. These were great coats. I wish they'd reissue them. But anyway, I put my Balmain red belt on. Yes, yes. Pulled out Michael. Added um, Patricia McGrath, Pat McGrath. <laughs> red i put it right on top of that pink and it just went right on so i've got the red lips i've got the red belt i've got the red bag i've got my red seven or nine hold red velvet cake shoes on oh they're so comfortable <laughs> these things you just want to hug them anyway and just some skinny leg little black pants from ann taylor from years ago banana republic black t-shirt long sleeves the necklace I got from that boutique in New Orleans that they have no more. And of course, any chance, any chance I get to wear these earrings, I jump at it. My Tory Burch favorite, favorite clip-on earrings that I love. Kept on just the Michael Kors watch and the old Juicy Couture heart charm bracelet. And I'm good to go. I'm in my yellow, black, and red. And I could have just put just all black accessories with this. And, you know, never, you know, miss the chance to make the look your own. Add your own belt. You don't have to use the belt that came with the, with the jacket or with the coat. I just put this belt on. You know, in times I get to wear this belt because I'm going to get my cost per wear out of this sucker. So, ladies, I hope you've enjoyed this short little Let's Be That Girl. I want you to be that girl. That when you walk by, and you go, oh, who's that? Is that somebody? Yeah, that's somebody. That's me. <laughs> it's you. It's us. It's we. <laughs> Just have fun with your clothes. Go through the closet. Pull out the classics. And I've yet to wear this coat anywhere. I want to wear it this year, hopefully. Last year, you know, my husband was very sick, so we didn't go a lot of places. So maybe I'll get to wear it this year before the weather changes to the hot, hot. But it's very lightweight. Very nice coat. Very. This was a, a treasure of a buy. Especially with the A-line. It just looks Parisian to me. Oh, I'd love to be in Paris walking down the street with this on, right? <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? But uh, again, ladies, check your closets. See what's in there. Change it up. Put your touch on it. You know, you don't have to always wear something just how it was made. Utilize it for whatever. And for all three of these looks, I just did a basic base look underneath. Because it was all about the coats this week. But... Again, I used what was in my closet. Nothing new, nothing new under the sun. I don't think it was, except for the lips. I have the new lipsticks. That was it. So, I hope you enjoyed this week. I love spending time with you. We're gonna do some more fashions next week because that's what this channel's about. It's about fashions. It's about encouraging you to get up and get dressed and look your very best because you are able and you can and, and you are favored. You know, and, and if you woke up and able to stand up, you were favored. When you opened those eyes up and looked around and started counting your blessings, you were favored. So you've been favored. So make do with it. Hello, hello. Anyway, 
you know, I'm hungry now, of course. But I enjoyed this time. Come back and see me next week, of course. And put your belt, pull out your coats and put a different belt on. Even with that regular trench, I could have belted it with something else, but it was so stiff. That tie, cinching it with that tie really worked. This is very soft, very soft fabric. So it could put a, could even put a stretch belt around it. Could even put a chain belt through the loops. Oh, you know that's another one. Put it with the big chain belt. Put it on like it's a dress, because you could almost wear it like a dress. But I like wearing the wide over the narrow pant. It just, to me, the balance is great. So I love you. I thank you. I appreciate you. And I will see you next week. Okay? Bye-bye.